rocket not make it? Yeah, it did. There, you shot a ro rock in midair. Don't see only. What the fuck? Music stopped. See, yeah, it's just flying through. I want the rock to stop being on fire. Oh. This is stupid in here because you gotta shoot the pieces of wood. higher up. I don't know. There's three pieces of wood, I know that. It's around here somewhere. Not being able to jump gates. There's the last one. I hope Resident Evil 7 is going to be good. <laughs> well, I've, the last one I. This is the last one that I've, like, wholeheartedly played. Like, I've tried to play th five a couple times, but I've never beaten it. S seven, after a playable one-hour demo and two trailers, um, it looks like they're trying to go back to the actual survival horror theme. But, like, you play as, like, a whole bunch of, like, new people. So I feel like seven might also be, like, a reboot to the series. I just feel like they hardly did anything wrong with this game. Like, they pretty much made the perfect game. Do you have any problems with this game? No. Um, I mean, the ammo is a problem sometimes, but... Of modern Resident Evil games, I'd put four in number one spot. What's your favorite original? Uh, two. And two was my first Resident Evil game. So Leon's just the better character. Shit, was I supposed to do something? No, I need to get down there. I need to get down. Damn. I don't think I played the first game until the remake when it came out on GameCube. I eventually did get the original Resident Evil for PlayStation. It was the director's cut on um, PS1. It's alright. The first time I ever played this game was Andrew brought this. I think he got this game from Cole. He had no game to play with it a dozen times. the end of the castle. So we're about to go underground. Up to this point, every game that's been ran has been done on the Wii. There's GameCube titles and this. After that, it'd be PS3, 360, and then finish it off with PS3. Oh, fuck you, bitch. I 
Oh, well, actually, one. There's one PS4 time. Oh fuck! And he's got a rocket launcher. <laughs> ah shit! This is where they have two fucking uh, Wolverine guys. Don't get in the way of the rocket launcher. It went like right between those two. Oh fuck! Is everyone dead? And that's why that went up. Good. Fuck that bitch up. <laughs> I think we're about to walk into a cutscene. Yep. This is about yeah. We're about to go underground. Oh shit. Leon! <laughs> Mr. Kennedy! Don't you know when it's time to throw in the towel? No! Leon! Ah, fuck. <laughs> I wasn't paying attention. <laughs> of course he has something awesome like that. Hmm. Where's the satisfying sound of one's impalement? Fall for this old trick. <laughs> How dare you! No more games! Kill him! Kill! Quickly! We shall prepare for the ritual! I think I ropes look awesome. Leon, you're alive. Maybe you have nine lives, but it doesn't matter now, Mr. Kennedy. I've sent my right hand to dispose of you. Your right, Your right comes hand off. comes off? Hm. Say whatever you please. Die, you worm! He's getting pissy. That's unfortunate. There's a guy over here that I thought was funny. He's just like kind of like laying up against the wall. You took my crown. Where are you? <laughs> this is where they start selling them. Or you can buy you can already buy the magnums, but they this is where they start like giving you the ammo for it. Right. I think at this point you can get the striker shotgun. Yeah. <laughs> Which is better because it's wide range. Where the fuck? Walking around. Oh, there's a ladder. Probably should have saved, but oh well. Yeah, because you're about to fight um, the right hand man. I'll fuck him up. He's all fast and shit. About to go through the door and he's like. <laughs> <laughs> That's who it really is. It's um, it's really Elder Taguro. <laughs> oh, <laughs> he's coming for you. I just think it's, it's actually pretty creepy how like he moves really fast and then you just burst through the door. Right. Go this way. Arrow point. My finger points. Oh shit. I'm running out of space. I really only need to get him frozen once. And then. Get him with the typewriter and he'll die. Damn it. I always expect A and B, and he, they send it to the shaking controller.
We're not allowed to check. Turn the power. I don't know why they can just get a voice to say that. Instead of making you have to read text. Because it's funny because it actually takes four actual minutes. Unless you kill him instantly. bullets. You sure showed that guy. You can take this. Uh, all these treasures that I'm not using anything. That's worth a lot more. Add four minutes. Oh, I thought there was somebody else. <laughs> That's what I thought. I was like, who's that? <laughs> It's weird that they have all this shit in our castle. I know, there's a lot of stuff just before this castle. I think even modern day stuff, what is this? No. Do they have a mine for some reason? Yeah, now you're gonna hang out with some villagers again. Yay! It seems Meanwhile, that Salazar is having difficulty taming the American pig. Pig. Salazar had his chance. Krauser, go get the girl. Oh, and uh, dispose of this swine while you're at it. Consider it done. It's like, are we supposed to know who this is? Wine, he's my favorite character of all Resident Evil. Really? You know who they were saying, right? What? Get rid of this wine feller, um, Leon. Oh. Uh, <laughs> like, what the fuck are you talking about? Wine. Yeah, he's the true hero. I thought you like Wesker the best. You did an entire fucking video series on him. I did. That is still today the most popular thing I've ever done for YouTube. Views going up to almost 10,000. Shit. My most popular video I ever did was my Ghost Napa video. Yep. I haven't done anything else that good. On Daily Motion, the most popular playthrough, ironically, is um, God of War 2. Who did you do that with? Did it with Andrew? I did that with Andrew. Yeah, but God of War and God of War 2 were like one of the popular ones on Daily Motion for some reason. I never got myself involved with Daily Motion. I'm just using it as a backup source. Because I. Just in case of my videos get. Or my channel gets shut down for some reason, at least I have a, a backup place where I can get my videos back. That's like, um, on one of my videos, usually, um, I have a copyright claim on it. It's because I just straight out use music from. Super Mario Galaxy without, like, talking over it. Oh, I mean, you still get, you know, you get tons of, I mean, I have tons of videos on YouTube with copyright claims, but... You just can't monetize them. Yeah. Which, we're only making sense off the videos anyway. Well, exactly. That's why I don't bother with it. Cause you know I can't wait at the end of each month so I can get 60 cents. They're, they're telling me to set up an AdSense account. Like, yeah. yeah, I've seen that. I ain't worried. Whatever. Once I, if I were to eat water, I would 
out because then that's where the more money's coming from. Yeah. I don't know where that guy's at. Is he up there? Uh, no. He's right there. Yeah, no, he's <laughs> yeah they like. This is the one area of the game where they like really throw chainsaw guys at you. There's three. Yeah. And there's like here. And then, like in the like, line, like there's like a rock room. There's two of them in there. Yeah. And then I think there's one. Um, I think there's a one where you do the mine cart bit. Oh yeah, there goes others. Fucking these villagers up. They're just trying to get me out of their fucking village mine. I'm not being a dick. I'm just killing them all. I'm the one that's trespassing. Yeah, because I think this is the last oh, area of the game where um, it's with um, villagers. villagers and chainsaw guys. Um, because when you get to the island, your chainsaw guys become Gatling gunmen, so... Yeah, and they fuck you up. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah, here's the two giants. Uh, for some reason, I thought the pit was open. <laughs> was like, was like, shit. <laughs> oh. Oh, you kind of disturbed their moment together. Yeah, fuck. So he kicked you. One, he's just standing there watching his friend. Oh, yeah. I swear he looked like he was gonna hit him in the back. He's like that. <laughs> you I was bitch. like, I was like, what? Rocket launch these motherfuckers. And he trips over the other one. That one's dead. Oh fuck! Why did I have to move at all? What an exaggerated way to fucking die. That was the most challenging fight of the night. You should go for this whole game with just a knife. Ah, oh, fuck that shit. You know how <laughs> long that would take? People do it. They, they consider that Resident Evil knife runs. It's fucking stupid is what it is. <laughs> I've been told if I ever did one, I, I would do it on Resident Evil 2. Because 1, 2 is like the shortest out of the whole series. Oh, just imagine there's one El Gigantes. You have to fight them all the time. And then the chainsaw people you have to avoid. And then you have to f kill people like Krauser and Sadler and Salazar. That should be almost impossible. Aw, oh, fuck more bugs. God damn it. I have to recover from that kick that I got. Got a giant toenail mark in it. Yeah, giants. You don't have to worry about them anymore. Fuck. <laughs> I think this might also be the last area with bugs. I'm not too upset about that. Fuck these bugs. Need to go turn the fucking lights on. Get the press weird button. Taking yeah. yeah, the castle definitely takes a good while. It is about 10 minutes to 2.30. So 2.20. <laughs> well, you know. You said that in a weird way. It's about 2 minutes to 2.20. They're not using it. And they just randomly have it. I don't know what to say. That's like the one villager that has the shotgun in his house. He's just using it as display. But the same villager also has a grenade in his cabinet. That's true. <laughs> what if one used door? You only get to use that door one time. Camera fucks me.
I think I killed a whole bunch of them actually. I wonder if they were able to knock you off. Mmm, maybe. That would suck. I've never tried it. Well, I'm not gonna let them do it. Where's the switch? Oh, fuck. Oh, yeah, I get Castle has everything. Yeah, I was about to say, don't go up. <laughs> It's the middle one that doesn't fall now. Oh! <laughs> Damn, that scared me! <laughs> because it shouldn't have killed me. Oh, <laughs> that noise! <laughs> Damn it! <laughs> Son of a bitch. I was, in, I was good. Because it only crushed my leg. Oh <laughs> yeah, you can keep on going. <laughs> Who needs legs? Oh shit, I'm rushing over that rubbish. But yeah, I thought I was clear, so I'm like, okay, I can stop here. And I was like, <laughs> and then you're like, oh. <laughs> I almost pissed myself. <laughs> so imagine, yes, you can stop in the light. I <laughs> just guess I went a little too far. Like that was just, that was actually my fault, I guess. And then you can take this. And combine it with this. And examine. And you got the full crown. And I think it's a lot more to sell it together than separately. Four three. One death in this chapter. <laughs> Made you jump. That was awful. I was like, oh my god. <laughs> three hours and seventeen minutes. Fuck. It's taking forever. I haven't been off the castle yet. I never realized how long this game was. Yeah, I knew from uh at least from Code Veronica up the games were gonna be pretty lengthy. See, we're not even really in the castle anymore, we're like in the area around the castle. I think the quickest I've ever watched someone get through this game was about five and a half hours. Uh, we're probably not going to beat that, because we've been dicking around too much. Code Veronica last weekend took me about a little over seven hours to get through. I don't see that's taking seven hours, but we'll see. They're all having their campfire. Oh. If you don't think we can sing this song faster, then you're wrong. But it helps if you just sing along. Bob. I don't. I haven't watched that episode of SpongeBob in years, but somehow I know all the words to it. Let's try the tap button. Oh, this, this is the underground part with the fucking chainsaw people. You have to do all that shit just to get here. Yeah, because that door that was right above there, that's where the giant Sazar statue is. But you need to get the stupid medallion before, you know. Yeah, I died here when I was playing because I let a, um... A lady with an infection, with a blade infection, survive. There's a chainsaw guy up there. <laughs> I let her survive and she killed me. Get rid of all these bear traps. I like how this guy's not alerted at all. He's like, what's that? 
Shut the fuck up. Don't call out now. Cover's been blown. What's that? God. Well, there's still someone around here. There he is. Oh, fuck. <laughs> the screen. <laughs> uh, there's something. A treasure that I <laughs> that I've never found before since my last playthrough. Yeah, there's like a scepter or yeah. something in here. I didn't know about it. I found it only because I died and I had to come back. It's like down there. They're kind of watch when their head explodes and look at you. That's fucked up. That's somebody's body. Desecrating their graves and shit. What the fuck do you think you are, bitch? Yeah, like, either way that you come into this room up here, there's a chainsaw person. But I don't know if he's dead yet. You go up there, he cuts your head off. Oh, as soon as I get up there. Hello? There's the key. I guess I killed him. But I don't see his body. There it is. Oh! <laughs> 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 They're like, hello! I'm like, I hear there's someone coming, but I, just, I thought they were coming from downstairs. You killed my sister! My sister doesn't look, look, look like me! Oh, no, I'll kill you! All these fucking shit. What? Oh, already mixed it. What's shit? See, again, take the key to the mine. They can stop me right in my tracks, because Leon doesn't like breaking locked doors. Oh, fuck. <laughs> Ow! I like how she slides <laughs> down the <laughs> slide <laughs> steps. <laughs> That's fucking cheap. I feel like there should be something in that room that just didn't appear. <laughs> just shoot the minecart thing before you even get in it. Yeah, that would be something. I'm sure someone sat in here and been like, what's supposed to happen? Oh, 
was her plan of action? <laughs> like, she didn't even get she shot. She ran right in front of the car. That's funny. They're actually running after you, though. That's funny. They'll never keep catch up. It's not like this Minecraft game. Really fast. <clears throat> I think you already passed where the chance where the chainsaw guy comes up. That's oh, and uh, there he is. Faster. I thought I saw something like right next to it. Like, okay. Oh, there is another section. Here's where I'll speed up. Dumb. See, if this is in reality, he'd be like knocked over, like falling like, on his back because it's going so fast. I don't think anyone's that good of a center of balance. Now you can, yep, you'll go straight back up here, where Salazar statue is. Yeah, fuck that. What is that? Oh, it's just a tape. I thought it was like a glass case. Can I get burned by the fire? <laughs> oh, can fire hurt me? It's like in the game Oblivion, if you walk on a fire, it, the, the game just acts like you're getting hit by a continuous fire spell. You should play Oblivion. Make you appreciate Skyrim more. Yeah, I've been told by a lot of people I should play the Elder Scrolls games. They've they kind of dumbed it down with Oblivion, but I think it's better than Morrowind. Morrowind came out in like 2001. <laughs> I, w I wouldn't mind playing um, Elder Scrolls Online. <laughs> I mean, I don't. This is such bullshit. Just let. What is preventing him from swimming? I say that about a lot of things. Why don't they just swim across? Why don't they just hop over the fence? It's like they only have that if they. I was telling Caleb, they only have that if they got the power from the cutscene. Because in cutscenes, they can do that. Right. Because they, they have cutscene power, but w if you're not in a cutscene, you can't swim. You can only swim in cutscenes. <laughs> I feel like I haven't activated something that was supposed to happen yet. <laughs> oh. I yeah, I think you need to start trying to, like, you can uh, get across, but you can't. Swim. Yeah. This doesn't even touch it. <laughs> Psychic powers. I was in though. Yeah, that's what I was thinking. I got this guy.
Ow. You wanna know what would be funny? <laughs> we get you get close to the to uh the end of this game and then Andrew randomly shows up and takes over. <laughs> Not like that, I'm finishing this. I still remember that day. I was like, I couldn't believe that happened. He's just like, just give me my friend. I'm like, dude, the fuck. <laughs> I laugh when he came. Just <laughs> glitched up onto the hand. Good luck. Oh shit. <laughs> For some reason, professional mode, that, that era is so much harder. Especially on the PS2 version. Like, holy shit. That's the reason I got a knife in the hand here. So nice you could join us, Mr. Scott Kennedy. This is a, you again. That's a weird way to say the that. The sacred rite that's about to begin at this tower shall endow the girl with magnificent power. She will join us, become one of us. This is no ritual. It's terrorism. Isn't that a popular word these days? Not to worry. We've prepared a special ritual Here, for you. Ready. Oh. You better get ready. You better get ready. <laughs> oh shit, fuck, there's a... <laughs> yeah, I was about to say, you better get ready. <laughs> I don't think I've ever died there. I was hearing you, but I was kind of like ignoring you at the same time. <laughs> it was like, uh, you're gonna get like a knife in the heart. Yeah, I was just on my phone. <laughs> yeah, these are the Donkey Kong barrel stage. And shoot the barrels. Um, I'm not sure. Ideas done. Ideas done. Let's find it. Yeah, I guess so. Did I break it, it? Yeah, it does give you the red symbol for hitting him. Oh shit, that one looks blue. See, like, I just shot his head off and, like, his entire hood disappears. Big guy, TNT. <laughs> Stop! You did. I died a lot of times here, too, because there was a guy with fucking. Dynamite, and mm -hmm. I got hurt. So I only had one. I had like one hit point left, and I just kept getting hurt on the left. Ew. And then I got lost where I was supposed to go. Is your guy? Oh yeah. Is that it? 
Yep, now you just take the slow ass elevator ride. Don't Guys are gonna down. start falling down. Fiesta! Fiesta! I remember I just booked it through here like I had no health. Like fucking no one hit me. Because I know there's a merchant coming up this way. Yeah, you're about to do the Salazar fight. Yeah, which will last about 10 seconds. <laughs> yeah, these are, these are some pretty heavy duty weapons. Well, this is as strong as a sniper rifle with one bullet and it's constantly every I try to talk with my hands. <laughs> you start knifing. Yeah. Uh, what's up, buddy? Good luck. <laughs> this is another example of what I was talking about when we fought the big cheese. Is he just planning on staying this thing for the rest of his life? I guess so. Because what happens if, you know, if he did cannonly one? What? I think it's time I paid my due respects towards your impressive and stubborn will. Mr. Kennedy. I forgot that the other man gets, uh, donated with this creature. I honestly don't even remember how this thing attacks. So I've always done this. I know it can, like, punish you. Guess after this, there'll be one less to worry about. What a cool guy. I want you to suffer just like I Oh, yeah? Pretty sure you're the one that's about to suffer. Butch. Where you at? Are you Wow, on the stream, you just started fighting. <laughs> like, it literally ended the cutscene. <laughs> that took... That was hard. I'm... Jesus Christ. I'm in. Yeah, you may not be able to sleep tonight. You really kicked my ass. 50. Gee. <laughs> now he's dying on the stream. <laughs> At least you're done with the castle. Yeah. You see, at this point, this is where, uh, on GameCube, disc one would be ending. Yeah, this is... I kinda know what to do after this point. Like, I've played a little bit into the... Is that a first-aid survey? 
but most of the times that I've played shit that I've played through this game, it's up to this point and then the game's over for me. Yeah, you just think like Ada really just takes you home. Yeah. Need a ride, handsome? Just, fuck Ashley, I'm going home. <laughs> okay. That okay. <sighs> okay. Last chapter. Yeah, because at this point, if you were on GameCube, it would say, please take out disc one and insert disc two. And my disc two was broken. You ever talked to Rainy Dog? No. I kind of forgot who she was, to you wrong with her name. <laughs> <laughs> I just remember since you played this game. Yeah. To take care of. Like, the last thing I remember See her me. doing, she never finished it, but she was playing Resident Evil 5. But that was the, like, the last thing she ever did on her channel. Women. Women. Oh, you get to see Salazar. I hate to break it out to you, but Salazar is dead. Yes. It seems that way. Sadler, why don't you give up and let Ashley go home? Perhaps you are disillusioned with overconfidence. Just because you killed my small-time subordinate. Sadler, you're small-time. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> Arrive in my cage of torment, my friend. Now we start the weird people with electric sticks and shit. Yeah, this is where it gets... Where they really try to fire back. They learn how to actually use guns now. And shit. They learn how to shit. <laughs> yeah. That's important. Leon really needs to do that. Now I have to go home. <laughs> I gotta go home. I gotta go home. Poo -poo. Oh man. I hear a bitch in the distance. <laughs> Is there a way that this spotlight doesn't see you? Um, I think either you can avoid it. I don't know if you can shoot it or not. I've never tried though. I was like, I would jump and the spotlight would be nowhere near on me, but the alarm still goes off. Probably, I don't know. If that's the case, it's probably. Well, well I guess you can knock it out. Huh. I just blew it. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, I guess if anything, you don't, doing that, you won't trigger the Gatling gun guy? Maybe. Oh, never mind. I'll stop fucking my fingers out. Oh, fuck. <laughs> He's right in. I'll protect you! <laughs> Oh shit! Motherfucking yeah, ass guy runs up and just fucking I'm getting rocket launcher out. He's far enough away. <laughs> guy just comes out of fucking nowhere. Oh, did you die like a little bitch? And then you gotta do the stupid puzzle. <laughs> Yeah, these guys are pretty funny. This guy's got a hat. hat, hat. Oh god. Why do you have a shield? Yeah, they, they downgraded the wooden shields from like wooden shields of spikes to just wooden shields. This is like, why? This is a weird place to have a shield. Like, this is like a construction site, almost. Right, you would think of anything, it would have been upgraded to at least metal or something. Like a riot shield or something. Some motherfucker was so with the crossbow over here. Jumps down just to get killed. Fuck, hey, that's hurt. Where the fuck are these guys coming from? Just keep dropping from up there. Okay.
this is probably not the right one that I need to go to first. I think sell Magnum Ammo for a lot of money. I think it's five hundred dollars per bullet. Yeah, I have to move other ones first. Yeah, you need to set the thing or whatever over there. Oh, I have to turn the light on first. Shit. That makes sense. I wanted to see if the sound effect of the knife came in through the mic or the, through the Wii remote. Oh, shit, where am I going? Like the laser is an actual laser and just like shoots Leon in the head. Unless <laughs> you die. <laughs> oh, I did not know. Because there, there is that one, there is that one room which I always say they copied this room from the first live action movie, um, where lasers can kill you. Or like the fucking like where he has to do like somersaults and shit. Yeah. When I think they're making the last one. Yeah, the final chapter. Thank God, those movies are so bad. Are they? Yeah, like, it's pretty much another Hollywood thought this is what Resident Evil is. They need, they need like, super nerd people to... The Degeneration movie was pretty good, I think. Well, yeah, but that was actually made by Capcom. Yeah. I just don't see the need for live-action movies of everything. Especially if it's based off of a video game, because you know how video game live-action films go. I know, they're, they're their own medium, and they don't need it. Like, they've already been visualized. Like, <coughs> with books, I understand, because you don't have a visual model to look at. I heard the Ratchet and Clank movie did alright. Did it? I've... <laughs> this past last year, and I guess the beginning of this year, um... I played for the PS2 Ratchet and Clank games. Uh -huh. I didn't care too much for them, to be honest. They were... I liked the, at least the second one. But, do you know on Facebook, there's this thing where, like, sometimes it occasionally shortens stuff down when you're searching for something? Yeah. There's one that they had for you, and it was, you were talking about... Um, playing Ratchet and Clank going commando. I'll show you the picture that I saved. Round David Rangy going commando first time. like, what the fuck? That's pretty good. I'm glad you saved that. I was like, I didn't think about it. I'm like, what does that even mean? And then I click on it and it posts you saying you're playing Ratchet and Clank going commando for the first time. Uh, Ratchet and Ratchet and Ratchet and going commando for the first time. <laughs> That's pretty good. <laughs> wow. What's up with that? Oh, oh shit. I was like thinking, I'm like, why is the camera making me look up? And I'm like, I know something happens here, I just don't remember what. Uh, I remember during um, the very first Resident Evil challenge, me, what me and Andrew did, because I, I got done about 6.30 in the morning, but he still had to go through all Resident Evil 4, and I told him, well, I'm going to take a nap. I said, you keep on going as far as you can, I guess, and because we still had it until about noon, <clears throat> so, you know, we had less than six hours to get done, uh -huh. and I, I woke up, and there was probably only about little under two hours remaining before 24 hours was up and I look over and Anders is asleep but he managed to get up to le right at this point really yeah I was like so I ended up finishing the rest of four for him I think he woke up right around the end of the game That's impressive for him to do that for. because he probably got maybe oh shit maybe a few sections in to like or he's probably about to finish the first chapter when I was done so
It's like all we wanted to do when he was here. <laughs> what, sleep? Yeah, you'd sleep until like 10 o'clock. Or at least until your mom came in. He, was he likes to sleep, don't he? Well, he works at night now, so he sleeps during the day. This guy hangs out in a safe place. How many chapters does this game have? Five. You're on the last chapter of the game. Really? This yeah. is a really long chapter? I mean, it's not super long. There's like a thousand bosses. <laughs> Motherfucker shot me in the head. I'd say the little island might be a... A tad, a little bit longer than the village area, but not, too much longer. not yet. Nowhere near as long as the castle, though. Yeah. You just put two thousand dollars <laughs> in the locker. I'm gonna put this here. No one will find it. Is this the, this is the place? I think where there's like people with a shutter. No, it's not. I see. You're getting awfully. Oh. oh. <laughs> yeah. Well, one guy's gonna like fro like run out of a, like a fire thing. Yeah, that's in this room. I He's think. like, what is he doing in there? He needs to come here, and he says, "Reminds me of my time at Or, or whatever that means." Operation. Just shotgun shells. Such a fancy uh, briefcase there. It's around here. It actually kind of scared me when he did it. Is there <laughs> I was ready for it this time. 